Near Winchester Bay, on the south central coast, Umpqua River Lighthouse overlooks the Oregon Dunes National Recreation Area. On foggy nights, its signature red and white beams illuminate the sky. The Umpqua River was a major port in the 1850s, the abundant timber providing building materials for booming San Francisco. But a treacherous entrance to the river became the ruin of many ships, and there were cries for a beacon. The original lighthouse, built in 1856, was the first in Oregon. But it was built on sand and soon collapsed. Three decades passed before another lighthouse graced this part of the coast. This time, plans wisely placed the new structure well back from the ocean and river. This lighthouse was constructed of two layers of brick with a cement overlay. The tower walls are five feet thick at the base, tapering to 21 inches at the top. Umqua Lighthouse stands 61 feet high, its focal plane hovering 165 feet above the ocean. The large two-ton French first-order Fresnel lens was crafted by Barbier and C of Paris in 1890. It consists of eight lower panels, 24 middle panels, and eight upper panels. A thousand hand-ground clear and red prisms shimmer inside the 72-inch diameter lens. The lens originally rotated, using a clockwork mechanism with a weight that would drop 34 feet down the center of the tower before having to be rewound by the lighthouse keepers. It is now automated, turned by an electric motor and illuminated by a 1,000 watt quartz iodine lamp. With its unique lens and signature red and white beams, the Umpqua River Lighthouse stands watch above the sand dunes of Oregon's central coast. <laughs>